Hello everyone, I am Trekkie1701C, and this is FS Port. Uh, I'm going to do a separate video for the second mission here, even though the first one was uh, incredibly short. I suppose that works out with the little cutscene that we had there in the briefing test, or text. So let's just jump right in. Alright, looks there like we've got an asteroid field here. There have been a number of recent by the Beetle Beetlejuice system. They've been making strikes on Terran convoys on route to the Beetlejuice three Beetlejuice times, does he show up? Jump point. The Vasudan attacks have been staged from a nearby asteroid field. Terran intelligence is certain that there are four so small attack waves responsible here. for the attacks on our convoys. There have also been reports of a Vasudan ace piloting one of the Seth class How powerful are these area. spiders if they're like doing damage to the convoys? You are to what sweep I the know. asteroid field and take out the four Vasudan attack wings. Be aware that the asteroids will be causing interference with your sensors. I don't recall you won't them be able being to target like the Vasudans uh, until they are near, but they won't see you either. Enough to deal with a convoy. But if you encounter the Vasudan Ace, you may use we'll your see, discretion uh, as to whether or not to that. engage him. Keep in mind that your primary objective is to take out the four attack wings. So we're Check supposed your to take out the inexperienced and pilots instead of the experienced guy because uh, I guess that totally makes the war effort easier. And, okay, no real good selection of weapons yet, so... That's a, like, incredibly densely packed for an asteroid field. Do they blow up a planet? Like, is the Death Star around here? Is that the Death Star? Because that's... That's a hell of an asteroid field. I mean, that's just, like... You know, normally in an asteroid field, like a real-life asteroid field, you know, if you're going into it, it would not be nearly this, uh, dense, just simply, like, it would, the asteroids would tend to crash into each other. Kind of like those two look like they're about to. Oh no, I suppose that they obey the laws of just don't here. give a fuck and clip right through it. Where's Alpha 4? Let's see. He thinks they're over there. So let's go ahead and just follow him. And, uh... Let's see if these little squiggly red lines lead to them. I think they do. Like I said, it's been a few years since I've played this. Well, I see... I think that's them up ahead. Answer wing on yeah, that's them. Go ahead and fire some missiles and see if I can kill them. I'm trying to even let go of the afterburner for to recharge. Okay. Stay still so you can die. Come on. There we go. Ah, I didn't get killed. That's one wing down. Yes, I could tell that there was a wing down because I helped shoot them down, I think. I don't have any kills. Pretty sure I killed that one, but let's see where this leads us off to, because it looks like there's more red squiggly things here. And there we go, I think I see some lights right there, so I think that's the fighters. So let's go through this uh, little asteroid field. What was that one Star Wars quote about how the odds are about navigating through an asteroid field? Even this density pack just seems easy. Apparently not hitting a fighter is a piece of hell. Okay, so apparently I've got somebody on me. Uh, crap, what was the target attacker eight? Was that, you know? Uh, screw it, I'll just shoot him down. are eliminated, but technically we haven't eliminated half the fighters, because I thought there, there was that eight still. Targeting Pisces wing now. Oops. Another set of fighters here. I like how they don't ambush you. Oh, shit. I'm, like, really bad at crashing into them. Might help if I 
gonna get right on to them. Let's see, I'm thinking that's the ace up there, because there's not nearly as much as squiggly line things. I'm pretty sure that's just radar contacts or whatever this is. So I've got ten missiles left. Okay, countermeasures. Yeah, that's the countermeasure key. Let's see if I can take them out. And I'm out of missile. Okay, I can get him inside. If he goes down and good, he's dead. Shoot an ace eliminated. Uh let's go ahead and stop so I can get some more missiles really quick. Uh let's see what was the time acceleration button? There we go. Rearming sequence aborted. Well, that didn't work. Great. I didn't get any missiles, and he rammed into me. Let's just go and kill the rest of these fighters, then. I think I see them. Just see these little lights down there, so let's go ahead and take them out. I need to rearm! Calling in a support ship! That sounds like a huge gamble, Alpha 2, considering that he will just ram the fuck out of you. Virgo, wing on scope! Okay, let's go ahead and shoot these guys down and hope that I don't die horribly. I like not dying horribly. And it looks like I might die horribly. Because my hole is at like 42%. 40%. Hit anymore. There we go. Wings are down. Nice work, Alpha One. Got to set man speed back on, but that doesn't matter because we're done. So let's just get out of here. There's a lot of fire coming from my ship. Nicely done, pilot. Oh, hey, I got a medal for crashing into things. To ensure that our convoy will make it through this subspace node. Dispatching the Vasudan A showed out standing skill. My recommendation, Tar. No recommendation is for you. We are awarding you the Distinguished Flying Cross for this accomplishment. They really don't monitor your flying performance at all. Well, I suppose that's another short mission, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sign off, and uh, I'll see you for the next one.